great you are welcome to my channel so in this tutorial we are going to look at how we can set up our professional business email account on our android phone so that you can reply to messages with your business email account without using your laptop so before you can do that on your android phone you have to get the microsoft outlook app from google play store so when you come to play store and you search we have the microsoft outlook and we have the microsoft outlook lit download the outlook one without the lit so that the setup will be easy for you so after you have installed it successfully and then you come to your outlook app when you open it you will not see anything you can see that you have added about three emails i have three of them this is the first one the second one the third one then the outlook itself so once you have done this this is the first step now the second step is that you must set up that email account from your web server i'm talking about when you have a website so you must have that email set up now in this episode i created an email that i'm going to use to demonstrate to you how you can set it up on your smartphone so let's move on and then i'll show you how you can get the details on your laptop or on your computer then when you come back to your android phone what will happen is that you are just going to put in the details and then easy and simple you can set it up just like i've set up the four accounts here so stick and stay let's get into it great you're welcome so we are looking at how we can set up our email on our smartphone so for you to do that you must create the email account first that is that represents your brand so here we are using golda at transfer after it has been created successfully Take note of the password that you use to create this one and then you move on to connect devices so this is the interface that will come now you scroll down and then you look at the information here so we are going to use the pop thread so you take note of the port number then when you come to that is the incoming server then the incoming server is transfer.com the same as the outgoing server then you are going to use the smtp port the number has been given so these are the information you are going to use to configure our email on our smartphone the email address the password you use to create it then the incoming server we are going to use the pop3 then the outgoing server we are going to use the smtp and then the ports so once you have this information and then you have successfully installed the microsoft outlook app on your smartphone you can easily configure them and then you can respond or reply to messages or send messages from your smartphone without using your pc in this way it will make work easier for you because you don't have to carry things around with just your smartphone you are good to go so let's go to our smartphone and then continue the it's your welcome back so now on our android phone all that you have to do is click on add now don't create new one when you create new one it will still be like you are using someone else domain so you click on add an account then you click enter the email here so the email you are going to use is golda then you click on continue so this is not a yahoo so you just click on not yahoo and then change provider good so here you can see from the screenshot of taking that you see we have the imap and then we have the pop 3 so let's click on the pop 3 so here when you come to the incoming mail server you are going to enter your domain there so that will be the ransaf 
gmail.com then you select the number that was given to you then you enter it there here the password you use to create the account that is what they are asking when you create it using your web server so make sure you have that password so i'll enter that password here and then you go to the outgoing mail server the host is still the ransaf.com you don't have to change it then the number that was given to you the port number you enter it there then the password is the same password you enter it again so after you've key in the information then you click on this max sign for the authentication in uh, to be accepted great so you can see that when the everything is intact within less than a minute you are done now you can see that this is the golder that we added so you see all done you don't have any messages in golder so here we have the calendar you can schedule appointments you get reminders and a whole lot so basically that is how you can set up your email in outlook on your smartphone so you can see golda at ransaf.com it's pretty easy and simple so thanks for watching in our next episode i will let you know how you can set up the email signature signature on your smartphone so that when you respond to messages you can add your details your position the company address and what have you so thanks for watching if the video is helpful kindly subscribe share it with your loved ones and comment it's bye bye for now